Yes, I mean, I, well, obviously I'm very cautious. I'm doing, uh, I'm doing uh, all the necessary uh, warm-up routines and recoveries that I did, you know, to, to make my ankle feel as best as possible. And I haven't felt any discomfort or pain on the court for a week already. So that's, uh, that's, a, that's a great news. I, I, don't, I don't think that it's going gonna, it's gonna to bother me at all. You know, I'm, uh, I already... Um, I already keep forgetting about it because I, as soon as I'm on the court, I, I play without thinking of, of my injury, and that's that's already a positive sign. Um, well, there were there were a few adjustments, I would say, not not, not anything in particular that was significantly uh, uh, a so-called change, you know, because um, I have the same team of people around me for the last six years. And we have a certain kind of routine that we respect for all these years of of, um, uh, of practicing and preparing and recovering. And uh, of course, every 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 body, you know, every individual is different. So um, I have tried to always kind of get as much as information about my body as possible, you know, to, in order to to get it to the perfect, most perfect possible state, you know, where. Where I would try to, you know, play consistently and 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 uh, back to back, you know, the, the big matches, you know, on a, on a regular basis, and still be able to recover after that. So, uh, I'm very glad that I have this this uh, very um, um, knowledgeable people with great expertise around me because uh, without them, I, I wouldn't be able to, uh, you know, find out as many things about myself, uh, you know, if I'm alone, you know. So that that's an important part of my life, you know, the team. Give me a big support, and uh, and we have that kind of uh, strategy and structure of, of our um, preparations that that really worked worked well in the last few years. That's a good question because you're 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 exactly right. There is a fine line between really um, you know doing enough and doing too much. So uh, sometimes less is more, and um, but in in my case I. I always like to to focus more on quality rather than quantity of uh, of hours spent uh, spent working out. So that's a kind of um, kind of mindset and, and an approach towards uh, you know towards all the practices that we have on and off the court for for many years because uh, you know body also needs to receive the information. You know you you can't uh, overtrain because overtraining means that you know your body does not have enough time to. Get all the information you're trying to try, trying to send it, you know, and uh, so it's, it's 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 complicated. There's a lot of thing in a lot of things involved, but you know, as I said, everybody has a different way of of routines and uh, of rhythm that they've been respecting for many years. Some players like to spend hours and hours in the court practicing. Somebody don't. I'm one of those players that likes to really focus um, more on quality practices, even though they don't go for you know for for many hours.